Welcome to our channel. Emma Stone and her award-winning career prove she's an Oscar favorite. Emma Stone has come a long way in her career and has proven her acting abilities with two Oscars. From the moment I first saw her as the girl next door in teen rom-coms, I couldn't help but fall in love with Emma Stone. Her offbeat delivery, huge expressive eyes, and casual magnetism have taken her from ingenue to esteemed Hollywood veteran. She recently won her second Oscar for Poor Things, adding her to the prestigious and surprisingly short list of multiple Oscar winners. Is she as big of a deal as the award shows make her out to be? Well, let's take a look at her career, from her endearing breakout roles to her winning performances. Whether it's perfect comedic timing in Easy A, emotional vulnerability in Crazy Stupid Love, or unhinged abandon in Poor Things, the following films mark her major turning points. These are the movies that made Emma Stone the incredible actress we know today. Stone's feature film debut as Jules, Jonah Hill's love interest in Superbad, didn't give her much spring time. Her performance left a big impression on viewers anyway. Stone showed a knack for making even the most awkward lines in the script funny, believable, and a little charming. Audiences immediately picked up on the quirkiness that made her effortlessly cool and approachable. People were already anticipating her playing a bigger character. She even earned attention for her performance with a Young Hollywood Award, helping to launch her into leading roles. Seeing her now, it's fitting that this movie was the springboard for Stone's career. The following year, Stone took on another memorable supporting role as the clueless, geeky sorority sister Nadia in the underrated cult comedy, The House Bunny. This was a perfect fit to highlight her unique sense of humor. I loved watching her group of misfit sorority sisters get an attitude makeover with the help of the exiled playboy bunny, Shelley, who was played by Anna Faris. This role allowed Stone to embrace her awkwardness, making her more lovable than ever. Whether she was passionately defending a dinosaur-themed bake sale or fumbling through romantic interactions, Stone's performance was hilarious. While it didn't win awards, The House Bunny has since become beloved by film fans. It was clear Stone would be a household name when she earned her first leading role as Olive Pendergast in Easy A. This sassy and smart retelling of The Scarlet Letter was so good my high school English teacher showed it in class. Stone's portrayal of Olive, the rebellious yet compassionate student who accidentally ignites her own witch hunt with a lie, demonstrates her sharp wit and ability to convey dramatic subtleties. Olive is cool and funny, but we also see the character's vulnerability. Beneath her facade, Olive feels frustration with the rumor mill, the sleazy guys who approach her, and the double standards of sexism that bubble to the film's surface. Stone's performance earned her a Golden Globe nomination and critical acclaim. Easy A became a modern teen comedy classic and solidified Stone's status as a standout leading lady. The help marked a shift in Stone's career from an endearing comedy lead to a competent dramatic actress. Her supporting role as Eugenia skeeter Phelan in the film serves as the rational viewer's insight into the not-so-distant world of 1960s Mississippi, where every upper-class white family hires a black housekeeper. Skeeter is a rebellious Southern woman when it comes to the social graces of her time who has a fiery drive to do what's right. Stone's character records the stories of her family and friends' black maids, with Stone sharing great chemistry with the film's leads Viola Davis and Octavia Spencer. This was a sensitive role that she undertook with poise and one that served as a significant step toward her acclaimed roles in the years to come. Stone's performance in Crazy Stupid Love showcased her signature silly charm while allowing her to explore the vulnerability of a character who gradually lets her walls down. Stone's character Hannah is a sharp lawyer with a dry sense of humor whose emotional guardedness hides her loneliness and yearning for connection. This was her first role opposite Ryan Gosling, whom she went on to collaborate again with in Gangster Squad and La La Land. Despite her admission that she has never watched the film after feeling a lot of pressure on set, she and Gosling have obvious chemistry on screen with easy banter and playful interactions that make viewers fall in love right alongside the characters.